to get upset on the Walking slowly and recovering from broken bones, bruises, and puncture wounds, 34-year-old Ian Snyder doesn't remember the moment he fell a thousand feet to the bottom of a mountain from the Ko'olau Summit Trail near the Pali Nachos Trail in Uwanu. But he and his parents wanted to say mahalo to the first responders who saved his life December 7th. For three days near the bottom of a waterfall, he survived with only stream water. I had to reach over all the way across to grab water with my, with my right hand in the stream. It was a little, little trickle. And faith that his life was in God's hands. I had made my peace and said, if this is my, if this is my time, I'm ready to go. But if it's not my time, I know that that patch of sky in front of me, that like I'll be able to wave at a helicopter. I'd made my peace with God. I will be okay whether I live or whether I die. That helicopter did come, as did a coordinated rescue effort involving first responders, the Oahu hiking community, and many others from down that dangerous mountain. Made it to Konohonui and fell like here. Based on what we saw from Air One and the terrain, we, we were amazed that to be a thousand feet down from the trail and to have survived is, as we've said many times, a miracle. We, we still are baffled by it. It's as you can imagine, Mr. Snyder, your call was the most memorable of that day. Not every day our department sees a situation like this. Falling a thousand feet from a trail is no joke. Thank you. Oh my God, can I get a hug? Yes. <laughs> Hikers who helped with the search wanted to meet the man they had been tracking on his social media. And I thought the best gift we could give to the family was that we had found a body. And um, when we found a whole human living and breathing and waving at the sky, I was like, Merry Christmas, I guess. <sighs> I'll show you what you were in store for. Have you needed to tell you?